This study for Corrida was painted by the English artist Francis Bacon in 1969. A torredor and a bull move around an arena. The circular space within the figures are presented forms of a narrow ring. Large areas of orange color structure in the space. In the foreground, a strange, formless mask disturbs the composition. In the background, a narrow opening provides a glimpse of a ghostly, disturbing crowd. The dominant red square is marked by a circle covered with a form. Which seems to be a bird of prey. Could this be the Nazi symbol? One might imagine that this element was taken by the artist from one of the newspapers he collected and that covered the floor of his studio. In the center of the representation, the man and animal appear to be one. The head of the man has lost its human form and appears animalistic. The circles of light and the movements in the circle space reinforce the vertigo of this violent dance. As he often did, Bacon placed a pane of glass before his canvas. This glass holds the spectator at a distance, but also involves him in the scene by transposing his reflection onto the composition. This painting constitutes the most accomplished of the three compositions that Bacon produced on the theme of the Corrida. He may have been inspired by the work of Picasso, an artist to whom he often referred. The present theme might also have been suggested by the writer Michel Leris, the author of several books about bullfighting and one of Bacon's personal friends. In any case, the present painting also reveals Bacon's highly personal touch, the relationship between bodies and space, and the disturbing metamorphosis of the human figure were among his principal preoccupations. Another later work by Francis Bacon, entitled "Carcass of Meat and Bird of Prey," is also shown in this gallery.